Fires at homeless camps happen often according to the Anchorage Fire Department. Steve Kirch tells us if anything is being done to stop those fires. Rebecca, an official with the Anchorage Fire Department says the department gets five or more calls at, for service at homeless camps each day, and some of those calls are about fires. A little less than two weeks ago, four fires broke out at a homeless camp on 3rd and Ingra in under 30 hours. Assistant Fire Chief Alex Boyd says some of the fires at the homeless camps are associated with cooking or people trying to stay warm. But he says the majority of the fires are illegal. Boyd says Anchorage Municipal Code says the building of fires on public lands is illegal, with a few exceptions. The Assistant Fire Chief says fire crews do try to educate people on the law regarding burning on public land when responding to an incident. However, the director of Anchorage Parks and Recreation says the, the municipality can't compel people at homeless encampments on public land to move. A court case called Martin v. Boise has set precedent that doesn't allow us to abate camps, uh, prohibited camps, on public land unless we have adequate shelter space for those that are camping there. We educate them on why we're there, what the concerns are, where they're at, uh, and ask that they abide by the rules in place that were put there for their safety. Um, again, due to our workload and our staffing, we're not able to engage with these folks in the field very frequently uh, and unless we've been called to a concern. Boyd says anyone who sets an illegal fire on public land is subject to a fine. Anchorage Municipal Code says the fine can be up to $300. The assistant fire chief also said he's not aware of any of the fires being arson-related. Rebecca?